Good day, Grade 7! Welcome to our PE class. Our lesson in 3rd quarter PE 7 is about developing fitness through Philippine folk dance. Let us identify the content standard. Performance standard. And most essential learning competencies. Let us review the fundamental arm position in folk dance. First position, second position, third position, fourth position, and fifth position. For the answer, here are the fundamental arm position from first to fifth position. Next, review the fundamental position of feet in folk dance. First position, second position, third position, fourth position, and fifth position. For the answer, here are the fundamental feet position from first to fifth position. Our main topic for today is exercise program through dancing tinikling. To jump start, here are the different signs and symbols that is used in dance literatures of folk dance. R stands for right, L for left, CT for counts, M for measure, X for boy, and O for girls. Short background of Tinikling Tinikling is a traditional Philippine folk dance which originated during the Spanish colonial era. This dance is a favorite in the Visayan Islands. Especially in the province of Leyte, this spectacular dance is usually accompanied by a song. Tinikling came from the word tikling, a bird with long legs and a long neck. The dance involves two people beating, topping, and sliding bamboo poles on the ground and against each other in coordination with one or more dancer who step over and in between the poles in a dance. Part of the procedure, you need to prepare two bamboo players seat on the ground opposite to each other holding the ends of the bamboo poles. Sometimes long pesos. It's about 6 to 12 feet long and 2 inches in thick. For the costume, Girls wears balintawak or patajong, while the boys wears barong tagalog and long red or any colored trousers with one leg rolled up. They both dance barefooted. For the formation, Dancers stand at the left side of the bamboo poles with girls in front facing the audience. To 
To understand further how the formation will look like, here is the illustration of the dancers and bamboo players 1 and 2. For the music of Pinikling, it is divided into two parts, A and B or binary. Count 1, 2, 3 to a measure or in 3-4 times signature. Another important thing about Pinikling is the bumble rhythm. Bamboo Rhythm 1 Strike bamboo poles together once by sliding them against the board or lifting them an inch or so for count 1. Open the bamboo about a foot apart and strike them twice against the board counts 2-3. This is repeated as many times as necessary in regular rhythm. Listen very carefully and try to follow Bamboo Rhythm 1 Lift strike strike 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 For Bamboo Rhythm 2 Strike bamboos once count 1 Open bamboos a foot apart and strike them three times against the board counts 2-3 with right left right hands of bamboo player number 1 and with left right left hands of bamboo player number 2. The whole measure is played like this. Listen very carefully and try to practice bamboo rhythm number 2. Lift, right, 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 lift, right, left, right, lift, right, left, right, lift, right, left, right. Lift, strike, 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 lift, strike, 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 lift, strike, 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 lift, strike, strike, strike. The next part is about tinikling steps. Tinikling step right. Hop with the left foot outside at the left side of the bamboo for count 1. Hop with the right between the bamboo poles for count 2. Then, hop on the left foot on the same spot for count 3 and raise your right. That is when the bamboos are struck together on count 1 and the hop is done outside. When they are far apart, the two halves are done between or inside on counts 2 and 3. Then right arm up about head level and kumintang the hand counterclockwise. The girl's left hand holds the skirt and boys on waist. Tinikling step left. Half on right foot at the right side of the bamboo poles for count 1. Half on left between the poles for count 2. And half on right on the same spot for count 3. Reverse hand positions. Moving forward, let us identify the different figures of Tinikling. Tinikling step, clockwise and counterclockwise, Koradang steps, Tinikling step sideways, feet apart, cross step, diagonal, and waltz steps are the figures of Tinikling.
And lastly are the basic steps of tinikling. Tinikling steps, travel, kuradang, double jump, cross hop, habayo steps, and waltz are basic steps of tinikling. For the next slides, try to execute the basic steps of tinikling using the step pattern provided. Tinikling step using the step pattern. Leap right count 1, half left count 2, then leap right for count 3. Kuradang using the step pattern. Step right count 1, close left to right count in, step right count 2, cross left count 3. Step right count 1, Close left to right, count in, step left, count 2, and point left, count 3. Double jump using the step pattern. Jump, jump, place feet outside or inside the bamboo. Cross half using the step pattern. Leap half cross, right over left, then half half step. Habayo step using the step pattern. Kneel, leap, kneel right or left. Walt step using the step pattern. Step right sideward, count 1, close left to right, count 2, step right in place, count 3. For the activity, Listen and study the lyrics and rhythm of Tinikling. Write it on an art plate and put the sign related to the lyrics. And for the performance task, to develop fitness through folk dancing, you will do this activity. Warm up dance exercise through folk dance. Execute the following basic steps of tinikling. Don't forget to get your heart rate before and after the warm up exercise. Tinikling steps, double jump, waltz, cross hop, and kuradang. That is the end of my presentation. I hope you learned something about developing fitness through Philippine folk dance. Here are the references that I've used in doing my presentation. Photos used here are from Canva. This has been your teacher for today, Mrs. Cynthia Soledad S. Aspe. Thank you for watching my video lesson. Before I end, allow me to share with you something to ponder. Dancing with the feet is one thing, but dancing with the heart is another. Keep safe always!